Hello and welcome back with our SPS video and today we're back on Rune Mary SPS, the number one community server out there. Absolute awesome semi-custom old school RuneScape based server. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to continue our little mini-series where we're grinding some achievements from an account from scratch, giving out some startup tips and everything. So I hope you guys enjoy the brand new episode. Really quick, before we go into the video, I'd like to announce the giveaway. We're going to be giving away three extreme donor chests to one lucky winner. It's a massive giveaway. So make sure to enter it, like the video, comment your name down below, and be subscribed to my channel. And of course, if you guys want to check out this fantastic server, make sure to do so. The links are down below, and I would say, let's get right into the video. So really quick for everybody that's never seen this server before, as I've said, it's semi-custom old school RuneScape based. This is the lovely home era right here. It is absolutely amazing. It is old school RuneScape based, but it got a lot of small custom features. As for example, we have a lovely uh, boss shop where you guys got yourself to be able to spend these boss points, which are very... Nice to get yourself a bunch of untradeable or even things as, for example, Emerald of Fortune, etc, etc. And you guys can also get yourself the lovely Pat Genie. Pat Genie, custom pet, which is providing you drop rate 5%, as you can see right here. And then you guys can combine into the best and slot pet, the Master Alex Pat. So, by the way, it's 31 players line right now. Off peak, peak around 60 replays every single day. So, definitely give this server a try. If you go here to the um, player panel, you guys can go into the lovely pat storage. In here, you guys can find every single pat in the game. The cool part is the pat Alex one is all the way at the top right here. So, this bad boy combined with the pat skiller, which you can get only from skilling, for example, plus the genie pat can get you guys the master Alex pat, which is concluding all these effects together and it's absolute fucking op there is even a little walkers pat which is so freaking funny and uh, yeah it also got some custom effects just go over it hover over it and then you guys can see the effect right here so pet source for example the pet effect auto loot a monster drops etc etc so they got some really really cool effects to check them out yourself pat walkers right there 15 percent magic damage and five percent drop rate in wilderness absolute sick and i would say let's jump on the other here we are on walkie time that is absolutely awesome the first thing i've realized is there is a nine hours and 33 left from double xp so on the weekends we have double xp very very peace so definitely sure to take advantage of that and uh, yeah that's the account we've started pretty freaking basic right here we're gonna continue a little bit of the grind today and um yeah so the first thing i'm gonna go ahead and do is probably some overall skilling since we have double xp and then we'll probably go for some pvming as well through slayer we shall see main idea of the series of course is to grind as many achievements as possible there was over 100 achievement added into this lovely interface right here achievements are a big freaking factor of the game important to mention is as well that they're literally completing if you guys complete these bad boys right here you're gonna be covering the entire content of uh, Rune Dream, which is absolutely amazing as you can see right here it's so many freaking achievements you guys can grind all the way from easy to elite one so that's absolutely awesome and we will continue the grind based on these lovely achievements so to claim a free mystery box i have to go out and vote so i'm gonna go ahead and do this so i can claim the daily one as well because there is an achievement to open a mystery box yeah let's do it there we go votes coming in we got five vote tickets and we got the mystery box awesome we've also got an achievement all the way democracy i think that's based on a freaking vote in there we go, another achievement out of the way. We've completed the Mysterious Junk. Blue Dragon Height set. Oh no, this is not too amazing. Vote tickets. Okay. And you can spend them vote shop right now. I think I'm going to be, probably, I'm going to be selling these so we can make some money. But I want to showcase the vote shop anyway. So to open the vote point store, you guys want to go to the corner of the home bank right here. The, bank, the vote booths. As you can see, these are the items you guys will be able to get. Let's see how many they actually cost. Wait, they cost only five for barrage cloths. Maybe I should be getting them because we got five right of bad actually. So that's actually not too bad. Um, okay. We could have gotten legend. Wait, never mind. 25 for legends game. That's nuts. Okay, no. We'll go ahead and get the barrage cloths. Yeah, I think that's a good fucking upgrade to be honest with you, can't. So let's claim all of these bad boys and get ourselves barrage cloths right there. That's absolutely awesome. I've just seen there's also XP lanes, double damage. That's OP. Lots of very useful items. So, voting helps with the server, plus very P for yourself, yourself as well. So, here we go, barrel gloves. So, as soon as we said, we're going to do some skilling to die. One really cool thing is that you guys have a lot of skilling stuff around the home. As you can see right here, we got a fishing spot over there. We got lovely wood cutting over there. We got a cooking place over there. And we have also mining place on the other side. That is absolutely awesome. So, we'll definitely go ahead and, uh, yeah, spend the time at the home. I think we have a little bit of extra XP as well while staying at home. And doing the grind side so that is actually very very fucking awesome so i've just grabbed myself some double xp um bonus right here because that's gonna help a lot with the grind i've just seen there's also an event happening right now so as you can see on the left hand side that's a skilling event if you guys manage to get an x amount of xp you're gonna get an event key which is very p actually so if you guys see that go ahead and do training skilling 
because uh, you definitely want to participate. Fortunately, if I do freaking mining, I'll never get the million XP. So I might have to go to some fear thing to actually manage to get the one million. If I want to participate in the event, of course, but sometimes I don't. But we shall see. Let me get this lovely smithing level up now. So 45 smithing coming in right here as well as 46 mining. Pretty juicy 90 levels out of the way. So since I want to participate on the event, uh, the 7.1 million XP have farmed already. 7.4, right? Holy crap, that's going to be going super quick. I might actually go ahead and do some thiefing right here if I can actually go and participate. Because for each of these bad boys, I'm actually getting, as you can see right here, 5k. So I get them 1 million. It's going to take me, I don't know how long, but it's really worth it. Because participant events is actually very pain. That's an achievement as well. So I definitely make sure to be participating. And it's only working with skilling. So um, yeah, let's get this 1 million in XP. Oh, and by the way, we're 82 freaking thiefing as well at the moment. That's sick. I think very soon we'll be able to go to the uh, Skimmy Slow as well, which is absolute crazy money. 85, thiefing coming in. Very nice, bro. I, I'm, I'm a bit scared that we'll not be able to get the 1 million XP because these boys are all grinding so quick. We're already 12.2 million, 12.3. It's going to be actually very, very fucking close. So I'm going to keep spamming as much as I fucking can. Let's go, boys. There we go, boys. 1 million XP coming in. Absolutely nice, I. We don't have to continue. We will get the event key whenever the event ends, which is going to be any minute now. And we made 700k. So freaking easy. Fucking loving it. Okay. Well, back to some skilling grind. There we go. We've just got the lovely event chest. Sorry, the event key, which means we can open the event chest. And if we get lucky, we can pull some really nice things from it. Let's go and see. Boom. Okay. I'll definitely fucking take that. Kraken tentacle coming in. Holy crap. So that means we need to get a whip somehow after that. We can actually go ahead and we have a freaking tent. Episode 2. What the freaking hell, dude? That is actually very OP. All right. Back on this getting right now. Another thing I love is that you can literally make freaking bonfires. Quality of life and room is very high because the server's been under development for over five years. So you guys can expect things like this to happen. So make sure you join if you want a fully super amazing quality server. 50 of Palazzo Wood coming in and fire making coming in. Total level almost 600. So, we've got 64 cooking, 57 in, no, sorry, 63 in efficient. That's 700 plus total level already. I like where this is going, and we will probably go for an overall seal update today. And, um, yeah, definitely get over 1k in total level. So, one cool thing is you can buy actually a lot of supplies at the Homer. So, I've just bought these, like, 80 gems right here. Cost me half my fucking cash deck, but that's okay, because uh, we gotta invest for the levels. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get the crafting even higher. By the way, another cool thing, bank value, as you can see right here, 39.7 million in total. I don't really know where this money coming from. Maybe from the Kraken Tentacle we've just got. And, um, yeah, we are 55 in crafting, as you can see right here. So we're doing very nicely, 760 total level. I like where this is going. Almost 80 crafter coming in. Next, I'm going to go and grab the Slayer task uh, so that we can do some combo trains as well. I'd like to talk about my task. Do I even have a task? I don't. Let's assign a task right here. Uh, we're definitely going for an easy one here. And a sand crabs. Okay, not too shabby. Let's get some range mage prayers up. Let's go. So, yeah, look at that. We got almost 900 total level. We got some range up right here. Doing pretty nice damage, actually, with the rune noise. Next, I will go and get some magic up as well. We got a freaking crab claw? Question mark? Rare drop announced? That is, that's funny. And, uh, yeah, we both hit one... Okay, in total level, that is absolutely nice. And uh, yeah, the way we're going to get it is going to get prayers up. Because we definitely need to get freaking prayers up to get some nice grinds out of the way. 1,000 total level coming in. That is absolutely awesome. I'm probably going to go as much as I can prayer-wise. We got two inventories of baby dragon bones we've bought. And uh, yeah, let's go use them on the altar. Let's go. Alrighty, we used all the lovely bones in the altar. We got 72 in prey, which means we can use freaking piety. Piety is going to help out so much with the grinds. Not even funny. Oh, wait, we need to get 70 defense for that one. F. I thought it's 30. But yeah, what a great episode. We've got over 1,000 in total of the day. Not too much on the achievement focus. Although, 
while doing all these different skills and all the activities, we definitely got some stuff up. As you can see right here, all the orange woods, which we're going to be completing in the next couple of episodes. So again, make sure to be grinding achievements. They're very OP. You get some really crazy rewards. Every single achievement got its own unique rewards. So definitely be sure to check them out. As you can see right there, and definitely play around. Because if you guys complete all the achievements, you have completed the entire fucking game. Right, that's going to be it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to enter the giveaway by liking the video, commenting, and giving name down below, and please subscribe to my channel and i'll see you all nine boys links down below thanks for tuning in as always have a good one and peace out